Hey, there you are. Good. How you doing? Okay. Good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it's just, you know, I've got to come to terms with, uh, I, you know, I doubt I'll ever see your sister again. I just have to accept that. Yeah, sure. Yeah. So anyway, um, yeah, so good. Good, I'm, yeah, when I don't. So anyway, I'll be this time. You can't, you can't run away from me, Jay, when I'm in Chicago. So, <laughs> I don't know if that, that's, that's a joke. You can't, that's a meaning. <laughs> meaning, I'll hunt you down. You can't. You can't move away from me when I'm there to see you. So, but uh, yeah, hopefully I'll be set, and then um, yeah. So we'll just have either morning coffee or whatever time. You know, I'll be totally free. So, you know, if you want, if you'd rather have me come visit you in the, at night because it seemed you know you're more active at night. So that's fine with me too. So I'll come in the evening then. Um, so yeah, yeah. So uh, what else? What else is shaking? Not much. Uh, nothing's shaking. <laughs> nothing's shaking. That's, shaking. For, that's for sure. What did you um, do? You I mean I think we've always had that discussion where. And that was my dad. It was like psychosomantic, right? But do you think, like, health, uh, physiologically, that if you're mentally healthy and if you can train your brain to be mentally healthy, that that also staves off uh, physical issues, too? Are you a believer in that, or do you think they're too tall? Yeah, I, I do take... I do what I do. I, I do what I do to make it normal. Right. But do you think, like they were saying, you know, like some Buddhist monks, they did a study that they're always smiling and they're always happy, and that that somehow equated to them not having many physical ailments or physical issues. Do you believe that, or do you think they're two separate things when we humans are either crazy but could be healthy, or do you think they they run in equilibrium? What's your take on that? I don't. Uh, I take more of myself. Right, but just not you in general, JB. Like, if you think a person is happy, happy go lucky, maybe as as your father would say. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, do you think they do you think they live a longer a more healthy physically healthy existence? It would help, yeah. Yeah. Right. And when you're and when you're negative or you know a, a negative Nelly, um it seems like the, you're more susceptible to physical problems. Yeah, more or less. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, what's the weather? Do you have any idea, or should I? I'll look it up online. I would assume it's I pretty. Don't know. I never outside. Yeah, you never asked the nurses. What's your What's your conversations with the nurses? Pretty limited. Absolutely no. Yeah. Do you have a Do you have a favorite or no? No. No. <laughs> well, I won this. More yeah. Than the others, but you know, just average. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, how often does the uh, attendant doctor come in, make rounds? Once a week? Yeah, okay. Yeah. You know, they come, they deliver food. No, the, they do no, what the, they need to do. Well, the, no, the the doctor, the MD, like how often do they come, come around? Once a week? Oh, every couple of days. No. Yeah, yeah. Maybe a month, month. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm just, well, I'm just, it's, it was, it's just hard. It's just a hard pill to swallow. Do you remember that mom's college roommate, this Pam Segetti? She was from Chicago too, but from Northern Illinois. Do you remember her or no? Uh, very vaguely. Vaguely, yeah. So, that yeah. Not so I guess she's been calling, you know, she's, I would assume she's the same age as Carrie, 78. 
So she's been calling into mom and speaking with her at, you know, at the facility. So I guess she just doesn't, Carrie just doesn't want to talk to me or see me for whatever reason, you know. So I believe, I believe Pam, I don't believe her guardian, but I believe Pam then. So it's just, it's sad. You know, I don't know why mom, why Carrie blames me for her going crazy. That's the type of logic that she, you know, it's like I have no, I had no, I had no, you know, did nothing, uh, mom, to make you, cra you know, you may, you, you are yourself mad, right? Like I didn't, you know, I didn't contribute, but um, somehow I contributed to her madness, right? So I don't know, but um, so it's just hard. It's just, it's a hard pill to swallow, not, you know, having government, you know, prohibiting family from seeing, yeah, yeah. It's like, well, it's like, it's, 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 Everyone. Right, but this is like it seems like it's like a that's like uh, uh, something from a communistic, like North Korea, South Korea, keeping families apart. It's well, a, yeah, it's yeah. Better, that, but they have a better state than than, than normal have. So all things better right. is a better deal. But do you, do you see like do you see this logic that so the state a.k.a. Florida, a.k.a. Pinellas County, can, can deem people incompetent and incapacitated to control them and control all of their money, but then somehow say that that, that person has a voice and is saying to say who and who cannot visit with them, right? It makes no sense. <laughs> yeah, you, you look at the ups and downs, it works. Well, yeah, we'll see. I mean, all these guardians get sued repeatedly for mishandling funds and then it's strict or it's removed from the website, from their, their the case, the, the their online website, right? Um, it's a scheme, it's just, a, it's a horrible scheme. Um, but it, it just doesn't seem like it's affected enough families yet for to, to gain, you know, complete, to have them change it. They need to ch revise yeah, this act. They, they, I mean, they, most families are very grimly. Yeah. Well, again, I'm happy they finally acted, Pinellas County, because mom needed this help many years ago, in my opinion. But then to bar, <laughs> you know, to basically hold them as prisoners in Florida. That's what it is. I mean, they're a prisoner. I mean, you can't, no matter how you cut it, she can't get up. She cannot leave on her own accord. She's a prisoner. Right? Well, yeah. yeah. It's... Hello. I'm oh. family. What? Uh, I'm the family. Hmm. Hello again. Hmm. I don't know where she's okay. starting. Maybe they well they hear you they hear you uh, talking they don't know if you're calling for them or not right yeah say that again I said they hear you talking on the phone JB so they don't know if you're calling for them or not the nurses they think maybe you're calling for them that you need attention no I don't know right right well yeah yeah so. Well, I'd like to meet Lynn Hill, but I mean, everyone's always busy, um, so I'm not going to bother her. You know, she knows that I'll be I'll be coming to see you every day. I'd like to finally thank her face to face, um, but I know she's busy. So, um, yeah, so I know I'll be really tired. <laughs> you know, my my body clock will be, you know, for those first couple days, I'll be like a zombie. But uh, I'll try to adjust as quickly as possible, you know. Um, yeah. Yeah. So actually, it will work out because, you know, I'm more the morning person and you're evening. So then it will flip. So then I'll be more active at night. So then I'll, you yeah. know, then, then it will be better for us to hang out. Do you know what time they, uh, they close the doors there, Jay, at your hospital? Oh, like that, yeah. No, do you know what time they close the front door? They close for visitations. Probably around 9 o'clock maybe or so. 
something like that. Yeah. So I'll 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 ask when I get there, and then yeah, they'll yeah. That that's that's about right. So. All right, buddy. Well, maybe either I'll shoot you a call tomorrow or every other day, but this time next week, I'm I'm annoying you face to face. Great. All right, and I'll bring. Yeah. Oh, I saw you shave, JB. You shaved. No, I just haven't do it yet. Oh, it looks like you did. So I'll I'll bring a straight razor if you want, and give you know if you want, and I'll give you a shave if you want when I see. You, all right. Yes. All right. I I'll love you. you. All right. Love you, buddy. I'll see you soon. All right. Okay. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.